How to use the bathroom, also known as how to use the loo, how to use the toilet, and how to use the restroom, and also how to use the water closet. Hello, and welcome to how to use the bathroom. Whether you're a small child who is adult enough now to use the big toilet, or simply a visitor seeking Western culture know-how, you will find this tutorial informative and beneficial. So sit back and relax, but not too much. We're saving that for the loo. Step one: the approach. First, one must decide whether he shall urinate or defecate. This can take anywhere from 11 seconds to 50 minutes. Take note that the urinal, while it does expedite your stay, is favorable for urinating only. The stall, on the other hand, accommodates all sorts of habits. The stall will be the focus of our video. Bathroom tip. Unless you are female, while using the facility, refrain from speaking with mates. Step 2. Reconnaissance. While you may share a park bench, the stall only accommodates one patron, or simply because the seat is too small for two patrons. Thus, you must find your own stall. To do so, nonchalantly peek under the walls. Do so discreetly. If there are feet, it is occupied. When in doubt, a gentle tug on the door will suffice. Refrain from rattling the door or bedeviling patrons. Bathroom tip. Listen for a courtesy cough. When a patron hears someone enter, they may predispose a small cough to coyly communicate that their stall is unavailable. Step 3. The preparation. After obtaining and securing your stall, judge the conditions. Make note of the tissue supply, cleanliness, pygmies, and security cameras. If the establishment is somewhat ruddy, take extra precaution. Germs are invisible bugs that make you sick, and they reside in dodgy bathrooms. To shield yourself from germs, use a paper liner on the seat. Bathroom tip. Fabricate a lining of tissue. Though 70% of germs cannot jump, as a precaution, do not touch or go near anything white. Step 4. The release. Take your trousers and your undergarment and loosen them down to mid-calf. Do not allow garments to touch the floor, as toilet splatters have contaminated that area. Sit or hover over the toilet bowl. Relax your bowels, and be sure all excrement stays in the toilet bowl. Bathroom tip. To decrease the chance of splashing, set a thin layer of tissue over the water. This will cushion your feces, greatly reducing having your bottom splashed with chilly germ water. Step 5. The wipe. Take the tissue and discard the first three squares. Previous patrons have adulterated those sections. Create a comfortable pillow of tissue, noting a firm grip with your fingertips while still protecting your hand. Lean forward, do not stand all the way up. Give a firm, smooth wipe to your bottom. Do not scrub, as this spreads the feculates. Discard the dirty tissue in the toilet. Repeat with a new cleansing tissue until relatively clean. Often this can take up to nine wipes. Bathroom tip. If you have an especially odorous installment, you may flush during your dormancy. This will decrease the exposure your waste has to open air, thus improving the bathroom's aromatic atmosphere. Please note, do not flush while sitting, as polluted water may splash on your bum during the process. Step 6. The Recovery Carefully stand, noting that protective layers may stick to your bum cheeks. Return your trousers and your undergarment to their respective positions. Push the protective layer into the bowl so the water catches it. If you are agile, you may use your foot. Flush the toilet by gently kicking the handle 
or more conveniently, using your finger wrapped in tissue. Stay clear. Toilet bowls are liable to splatter pollutants. Use a tissue to open the door handle, or you may use your elbow if you are able to. Step 7. The cleansing. Turn on the water, rinse your hands, and take a small pump of soap. Rub your hands together. You are free at this step to speak with other patrons and look them in the eye, but only if they are at step 7 as well. Take a paper towel, dry your hands thoroughly, and turn off the water faucet with that paper towel. Discard and obtain a new paper towel to open the door. As you are leaving, quickly discard the paper towel in the trash. If you are unable to do so, innovate a way to discard the paper towel without someone noticing you. Bathroom tip. Thoroughly dry your hands, as patrons may assume you have urinated on yourself. Congratulations! You just went to the bathroom. Now wasn't that easy? Seven easy steps to perfect your bathroom experience. We will catch you next time.